your child feel extra special as they kick off distance learning, we might be able to help you out. Lori Wallace is live with some back to school treats. Back to school. Hi, Hello. Lori. Yes, good morning, you guys. It's a little bit harder this year, right, to get the kids prepped and ready and get them set up for that first day of school. But we have the perfect way to make it special as they head out the door. So I have Kelly and Amanda here to talk a little bit about their businesses and what they're doing to make the start of the school year special. And it's a cookie business, Lebby Do, right? Yes, Lebby Do Cookies. Um, I've been in business since January, I'm making cookies for about a year and a half. Um, and this year for back to school, I have two little cookies. Um, an apple and a backpack. Uh, this one is for a student who already got started this year because some schools have already started all our year round kids. So she's off to a great start. Um, and then customized with every grade level. I've got third grade, fifth grade, first grade. I have a college sophomore in here. Uh, <laughs> oh, cute. Yeah, so just a really fun way for kids to get excited about this school year. Um, you know, a lot of things are different this year, but it's still an exciting year. Yeah, so how much are the cookies for the cute little packaging there? Yes, um, the cookies are $10. My next pickup is on the 23rd. Um, so if you're interested in ordering, just order by uh, the 17th. And how did you get started doing all of this? Because it kind of ties right back into school. <laughs> yeah, it does. So actually, um, Amanda and I are in the PTA at Edna Beatty, and we wanted to make staff appreciation cookies. And so I started watching a bunch of videos on how to make sugar cookies, and that kind of started the whole thing. Yeah, if I was going to be making staff appreciation cookies, they wouldn't look like that, and I probably wouldn't be starting a business as a result of it. But you two little cuties are getting ready to go into second grade. What are you excited about? Um, to see my friends again. Yeah, you get to see them all on Zoom, and you're a pretty good Zoomer from what I hear. And what are you looking forward to? Um, reading. Reading. So good. <laughs> and you have your own little business, Amanda. This is some of your stuff here. You kind of do all the swag. So the girls' shirts, yeah. that's all you. Yeah, it's always fun to have um, custom apparel. And we have these zooming into second grade to kind of um, memori memorize the uh, times of distance zooming, learning. distance learning. <laughs> a unique occasion that yeah, we're all heading into, yeah, right? Exactly. Where can people find all this fun stuff? Uh, my shop is To You Love Us. And we are on. Um, Instagram, Facebook, Etsy, look us up. We also have our school swag to keep kids excited about school and to take to school and hopefully yeah, we're able that, to go that, back. That'll look perfect on the Zoom call right next to you. <laughs> exactly. Thanks, guys, so much. Good luck on the first day of school. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio looking for ways to just make that first day seem a little bit yeah. more yeah. special. Back yeah. over to you. I love it. Little pops of color. If Lori and I had a cookie company, it would be revenge cookies because <laughs> our cookies wouldn't be very good. <laughs> So I'm a uh, terrible cookie baker. I don't really? know why. I just remember we did a cookie uh, a frosting contest. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the worst day of my life. <laughs> my back was hurting. I was Carol was like, "What is wrong with you? You're just making sugar cookies." I'm like, "I know, it's terrible." <laughs> Can I just buy a box? Oh my god.